Hello everyone and welcome to another live from the workshop. So today we are going to be making an Osgood figure. So uh, I was pondering which figure to actually use, uh, so, sorry, which um, outfit of hers to actually use because obviously she's had several. She's had her original one which was the scarf and then she had the uh, Day of the Doctor one which was the converse, the bow tie and the sort of leatherish uh, jacket and then when we recently saw her in uh, the Zygon episode she had a bit of a sort of 7th Doctor uh, slash 5th Doctor look going on. So I couldn't really decide um, which one to go for so I decided to go for a bit of a mix and come up with my own sort of outfit uh, because at the end of the day it's whatever the Doctor would wear um, uh, Osgood would wear. So I'm going to go for the scarf uh, because I actually have a lot of these lying around um, spare. Um, so uh, I decided that uh, this would be a good use of one. We have the Seventh Doctor's jumper, and then this is the uh, collar piece from a Roboman figure, which has literally just been, um, which has been uh, trimmed to fit inside there. Bow tie as well from the Eleventh uh, Doctor. Now the head, I'm using a uh, Primeval Helen Cutter head with some repainted, repainted. Bracewell glasses, uh, I need to trim those down to fit on, uh, so uh, that's going to uh, hopefully go together well. The actual body itself is overall a Bracewell uh, torso and hands, obviously it's got a slightly manly uh, look to it, but uh, it's uh, the best that I could do with the parts that I had. But uh, just to try and rectify the uh, legs a little bit, I've uh, used some Rose Tyler legs. Uh, I've done a quick mock-up of putting all the pieces together and I think it actually doesn't work too badly. Um, so uh, the first things first is going to be to glue on uh, some of these bits and get the glasses trimmed down to fit. So let's get on to that now. And here is my finished Osgood figure. So, um, really pleased with the, the how this has come out. Uh, basically, for the scarf in the end, I used an additional piece from a spare scarf. Obviously, if you look closely, you can see the join, but uh, it's, you know, from a distance, looks decent enough. Pretty happy with how the uh, bow tie and the shirt came out and the head with the glasses. Obviously, I realized that uh, Osgood's hair parting isn't the same as Helen Cutter's, but just as a head with the ponytail, it just works well. I think it's it's good, looks good enough for me. And um, yeah, I'm actually really pleased with how the uh, how the figures come out. So as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, favorite, subscribe, share, it really helps me out a lot. And I will see you all with another video very soon. Yeah.